Hey there, I'm Peck, the white-lipped peckery, and I'm going to be teaching you about my friends and I. We live here in the Amazon rainforest, and we mostly eat fruits, nuts, and roots. We love going to the watering hole when the weather is dry. We travel in herds to search for water and food, but mainly to find protection against our predators. We naturally trample the ground as we travel, creating holes in the mud, which are used as breeding places for our friends, the insects and frogs. Due to our big size, we also cause seeds from plants to be spread across the forest. However, while I'm used to having everything that I could have asked for in the Amazon, now my home and life has been turned upside down by the impact of human interference. Due to our land being taken for human use, like road building, cattle ranging, and other farming aspects, we have lost up to 89% of our original territory. Now there is only small pockets of the forest left for us to reside in. Along with this, us peccaries are also mass hunted to be used as food or as prizes in illegal markets. While scientists cannot pinpoint our exact number, it is clear that our population has faced a rapid decline and will continue to do so if given the conditions we are placed in. If we go extinct, meaning there is no more white-lipped peccaries left, it will have a big impact on the forest wildlife and the people who live in Mesoamerica. Traveled in groups of 10 to 200 and even up to 2,000. However, our numbers have dramatically decreased because of deforestation, meaning trees being cut down, as well as human need to expand farmland and demand for our meat. Unless something is done to protect us, we will go from endangered to extinct quickly, meaning that we will no longer exist. Protecting our wild lands from deforestation and farmland, as well as limiting hunting of my fellow peccaries, are just a few ways to help our survival. WCS is in the process of organizing ways to stop our dramatic decline and help restore our numbers. In 2008, WCS implemented the range-wide planning exercise for the white lip peccary, where experts thought of ways to save white lip peccaries and their habitats. WCS is also currently monitoring white lip peccary hunting to make sure that it does not cause long-term harm to their species. All in all, WCS uses sustainable conservation methods to ensure the survival of white-lipped peccary populations.